Dr. Weeks, we've been talking about vitamin C and the broad range of uses that it has, but you told me that it also helps with stem cell research, and there's been, there have been some studies. Could you elaborate on that for our viewers? Yes, actually that's a very exciting and interesting set of research which has implications for the use of vitamin C, not only, not only as a supplement in people, but also as a research material. Mm -hmm. Stem cell research is, can be very important as far mm -hmm. as uh, right. regenerate regeneration and studies involving regeneration of tissue. And scientists have found that supplementing the culture medium that they are growing the stem cells in mm -hmm. helps the stem cells grow and differentiate more efficiently. The vitamin C. The vitamin C added to the culture helps the stem cell culture. That's very exciting in and of itself that, mm -hmm. that vitamin C has that application outside of the body and mm -hmm. in a culture dish. It's also exciting to think that when a person receives stem cells, right. supplementation of that patient at the time with a vitamin C, especially a formulation that can get into that patient quickly, mm -hmm. which might give, okay, only a narrow advantage early on, could have dramatic implications as time progresses as far as maintaining those stem cells and helping that graft Mm -hmm. survive and improving the regeneration over time. So while vitamin C is potentially very good for stem cells in the culture dish, which research is showing, okay. it's also exciting to think that when you take it out of the dish and put it in the patient, the patient should receive vitamin C at that time to give those stem cells the best chance for the maximum possible tissue regeneration. Well, that is very exciting. Yeah, I'm glad that. that you talked about that. Thank you, Dr. Weeks. You're